let's go to the hitting side. Okay. Okay, hitting side. So we're gonna go um, batting average. Single season batting average leader. The average was 439.7. What? Yeah. 439. Pre or post depression era. He's very dead. <laughs> like over 100 years dead? He, he, he probably played against Tim Keefe and. Uh, well, probably not because no one can hit Tim Keefe. Are you saying same era? <laughs> uh, I have no idea. It was it Onus Wagner? Hugh Duffy. Okay. I've heard the name. 1894. Okay. Tip O'Neill. Was that the Speaker of the House? Tip, yeah. tip O'Neill. Yeah, 1887, a different guy. Um, we got uh, Nat Blasio. Really I'm like trying to think. Rogers Hornsby, people know that name, 1924. I'm thinking modern day, yes. Modern day. Let's go modern day. Ted Williams. Modern is day. Ted, is is it, is Ted Williams the last one to go over 400? Yeah, four, yeah 405. Because Matt Mauer was right there a few years ago. And he ended up fading just down the stretch. Check this out. Billy Hamilton. The. This is the guy I was talking about before. There's there going to be some more interesting stats on Billy Hamilton. It's just not, this not, might, not the Billy Hamilton we think about. Well, he may be. <laughs> wait, wait, wait till we get to him. Billy Hamilton hit 403. Um, if he can get half of that this year, <laughs> he's going to steal 400 bases. Uh, wait, wait, we got here. 390. Didn't um, Boggs come close one year? Yeah, I, I feel like they Babe all. Babe Ruth hit. 392 one year. Late Babe Ruth didn't play against black people either. Jesus. So his his stats. What does that have to do with? Because the because the competition's just down. That's why all these numbers are down. Billy Hamilton if you're not hit gonna... 389 too. <laughs> it's pretty good. Uh, I'm surprised he was allowed to play in this era. Rod Carew 388. But that's my argument against all the steroid stuff. By the way, what? if you black look people. Dominican players, Caribbean players, international players, black players. The competition was so watered down back pre Jackie Robinson that you, know, you were facing scrub pitchers. You could hit, it would be like batting practice. Of course, you're going to hit a bunch of home runs and hit 425. Billy Hamilton hit 380. Uh, gee, this Billy Hamilton, he's going to. I got to look and see if Hamilton's in the. Uh, see if you can get his retro stats going. Hamilton, is he in the. Hall of Fame? He's got to be in the Hall of Fame. That, that, that doesn't... He's, he's not, but what is... Okay, listen, look at his career stats. How, how well do you think this guy would do in baseball wait, wait today? Wait, we get to Hamilton's run scored and stolen bases? Five foot six, 165 pounds. Wait. Come on. He averaged... Uh, what did he average? Look, look, look at his stolen bases. 111, 102, 111, 197. In batting... <laughs> Batting average. You're just killing it in 1895. 325, 340, 330, 380, 403, 389. How's this guy not in the Hall of Fame? I don't know. You got to take it up with the take it up with the voters. Maybe they think he's real life, Billy. He's Hamilton. got his own page here. All right. Well, well, let's, let's, all right. right. Average so, leader, Miguel Cabrera. Miguel Cabrera. I, he's won the batting title. Uh, give me somebody else. But he's won the look. He's won the batting title three years in a row. Yeah, that's, that's one league. Did he win it in both leagues? I can't remember. Maybe. No, oh, it didn't. Uh, He's the safest bet to keep the average up there. I mean, Maurer could be in play. Uh, Buster Posey could be in play. Yeah, in Colorado won it last year in the National League, right? Kadire. Kadire. Yeah, yeah, but his batting average of balls in play was like 100 points above his career average. He's going to regress. Not huge, but he's not going to hit 330 again. What, what was uh, Chris Johnson's bat? Really high, but in his circumstance where he only faced platoon batting. Okay, his so he's line, only batting when he gets lefties. His, yeah, his line drive percentage was, it's a great role for him, but his line drive percentage was through the roof because he was always in a favorable matchup. Something that he'll do again this year. But if they put him in against righties, expect to see a big decline in 